Hey guys, welcome back to the channel again today. Today we're going to talk about multiple lights coming out of one box, uh, or sorry, one power feed with multiple lights out of three boxes. So behind me, you can see we have a three gang box. I'm gonna flip the camera around here. There we go. So this box controls outside lights, and it controls hot lights here in the entry, and it controls a light out here by the fireplace. So what's going on is the fireplace light is on all the time, so obviously, uh, we have a wire on the feed that shouldn't be on the feed and we need to put a double sideways switch. But in particular, when you're doing lights like this, I just wanted to point out that we have one feed coming in so you can see all our blacks together and all our whites together. Um, and that's all the whites are all the white neutrals that go to the lights, the associated lights on the power feeds out. And then this would be the main power feed coming from the electrical panel and this is live and off of this this would go to each switch so you can see there's a pigtail coming off going to each switch and then from the load side of that goes up to each set of lights so that's how you would connect wires together uh, in the back of a box when you have multiple lights on uh, one power source now I should mention that when we do one power source with multiple lights, we can only run up to a maximum of 12 lights on that circuit, unless it's specifically for load rated lights like pot lights. So when we do pot lights, especially LED, if they're seven watts a piece, then we're allowed to add up those lights until we hit the maximum of our 15 amp circuit, which is 1500 watts at 80%. Um, so that's a lot of lights from one power source, which we can do, but those are very specific situations. As a rule of thumb, we should never go more than 12 per circuit because we don't know what the client is gonna put on there for a light fixture. It could be something that draws a lot of power, etc., etc. So keep that in mind when you're having your home wired or anything like that. So we've gone ahead and made all our proper connections. Uh, remember guys, what I talked about with the light fixtures loading on one circuit. Uh, that's important. So we hope you like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you guys next week.